The reason students get this wrong is because they make this one simple mistake. Remember that a binomial is a single expression. So if we have this binomial, 5x squared minus 6x, and I'm subtracting another binomial, that means that I need to apply that negative sign to both terms. What a lot of students are going to do is come in and write the problem just like this. And what happens is that when you write it like this, the sign for 2x is going to be incorrect. So now, once we drop the parentheses, first expression stays the same, but the second one, 3x is now negative, and 2x now becomes positive. So when we simplify, 5x squared minus 3x squared will give me 2x squared, and negative 6 plus positive 2 is going to give me a negative 4x. So when we look at our answer choices, this is going to be answer choice 1. However, if you did it like in blue, when you combined negative 6x and negative 2x, you would have gotten negative 8x and you could have possibly gotten B as an answer choice. Please be mindful of this.